you know the journey as it always is has a lot of oh yes going here Absolutely. and there and it's not always easy it is not always yeah. easy and you don't always meet people that share the same views you don't always meet people that uh, are, are there for the good of it there's all kinds of different things so that's another one adversity mm -hmm. let me talk about adversity how do you deal with the adversity because certainly we've talked about all the great things mm -hmm. and I don't want to bring any negative spin to it at all mm -hmm. but then when you wake up in the morning and then you're dealing with you know fixed set of things but things are not always that easy you have to iron things out to make mm -hmm. them work how do you deal with adversity well, as cliche as it might sound, adversity is the most important thing of growth. Okay. Okay. Right. Without that, that cliche, you cannot it's grow. It's true. It's true. You cannot grow without adversity. Okay. Yeah. If you want to imagine uh, uh, running a company or growing a company without adversity, you are firstly completely fooled. Yeah. Um, secondly, you cannot. I mean, it is absolutely important for you to have adversity a not because you learn from that also b then you become more confident more determined more mm -hmm. sort of uh, passionate that hey i want to deal with that adversity and mm -hmm. come out of it mm -hmm. and prove that was the negative thing i mean we started this company literally a few friends got together and we said okay we are going to have a show on tv and we were watching oprah actually incidentally mm -hmm. we were watching oprah and we thought um, hey, why don't we have a talk show for us, for our lives, you know, because it is so dynamic, so different from other lives, you That's know, right. we come here, we carry so many values, I mean, it all comes with our upbringing, our heritage. Um, I see a stark difference between, you know, Asians, immigrants. Uh, who come here, uh, their value system, their knowledge, their understanding, their all of that is a lot superior or a lot different or a lot deeper, I mm -hmm. should say. Mm -hmm. um, I felt that, you know, there should be a show that is about us, by us and for us. Mm -hmm. So immigrant, women, minority. Yeah. Yeah. So all of that being the negative becomes now the positive. Right. And yeah. it's a great place to be and in time and place to be in this country where you're an immigrant, you're a woman, um, you're a minority, you want to own something, you want to do something. I mean, there's so much help for that. Mm -hmm. Welcome to a very special episode of Women Now. The South Asian community in the U.S. compared to other ethnic communities like the Chinese or the Hispanic is in fertility industry in the United States has grown to a multi-billion dollar business. Singer, songwriter, entertainer, Jasmine Sanders is an up-and-coming name to watch out for in the Desi music scene. Very, very special treat for you. We have Bollywood singing legend Kavita Krishnamurti Subramanian. <laughs> I first came here as a graduate student way back in 1975. I was starting over from scratch. I had to relearn everything I thought I knew about music and my instrument. Uh, my concerts have been more than entertainment, not just for the audiences, but for me also. In fact, the, the, what I often say is that the iPhone I carry in my pocket has more computing power than existed on the entire planet the day I was born. Thank Absolute honor and pleasure talking to someone who I've adored, admired. Gone are the days when humans made technology. Now, technology makes humans. Now, let's talk about the vision for the future. I think uh, Women Now has to become a household name, which a lot of it is now already. Yeah. Um, but I want more people to come together, um, mm -hmm. believe in this platform, uh, and become a part of it, and learn and grow and get inspired from it. That's typically the vision. Uh, but I have never laid out something for like five years or 10 years from now. Uh, it's like now is important and that's why it's women now. Okay. So today, right now, at this moment, this is the most important thing, right? right. Um, what happens to Bakal Ho Na Ho, right? Tomorrow, yeah, you know, knows. will always be better is because you've done something right today. Well, congratulations on eight years and many, many more years to come, hopefully.